the purpose of uh, this uh, lecture is to show how easily we can add references in uh, latex and uh, what are the benefits of uh, and what is bibtex and why we uh, why it is necessary for a researcher to use bibtex although there are different softwares uh, being used like endnote and uh, Mendeley, but uh, I prefer uh, using Bibtex. So first of all, uh, the benefit is uh, you have to just make a library file, add as many references as are related uh, in this library file or in this Bib file. So whenever uh, you cite it, that cite uh, citation. Uh, or that references will be appeared in reference section. Doesn't matter, you have uh, hundreds of references here, uh, but only the cited references will be used. So how you can make web text file? First of all, go to, uh, uh, there are many ways to make it just go to the research paper which you want to cite and uh, use uh, the bib text format and copy that format in this bib file otherwise go to google scholar i will show how uh, how you can do it just type scholar dot google dot com and enter the query or enter the research uh, name of research paper which you want to cite so if you uh, write here for example natural language processing and there are many papers uh, research papers for example i want to use uh, latest research paper, so I have uh, filtered it. And then, for example, transformer, the art, state of the art, research paper, uh, the state of art, language uh, processor. So I click here, and then I click bib text. They are, although they, uh, Google Scholar has given different formats like MLA, APA, Chicago, Harvard, because you can use it um, uh, these uh, otherwise just click bib text copy this reference and then paste it in your uh, bib text file for example i paste it here so this uh, in this way we can uh, make your bib text file uh, larger and paste it the relevant papers here so there are different formats for uh, different types of research art, uh, articles like for article it should be at the rate of article then there are some necessary uh, parameters like title author journal uh, you can have in proceeding or, or you can have at the rate of book if you want to add book and you can within the curly braces uh, you can add everything uh, related to uh, book uh, or phd thesis or ms thesis or web reference anything you want uh, want uh, add you can have here or for uh, uh, things which are not categorized you can use at the rate of miss at for miscellaneous you can set up manually or copy it from the google scholar or the specific journal i copied it from uh, here you know, from the google scholar so if, if I want to refer it, uh, I have to 
uh, there are uh, I have made a sample example file here. Uh, I have used, for example, uh, bibliography style abbreviation AWBRV. Well, we will discuss uh, these formats uh, separately and we will show what will be the output of each format. So first one abbreviation and I uh, have included my uh, bib text file here uh, slash bibliography and the file name my bib. And uh, if I want to cite something, then I have to use a uh, site tag. And for example, the recent copy we have made about Wolf uh, Transformer, we will use it. Every uh, BibTeX entry has different parameters like title, author, journal, volume, number, and this thing before uh, title or starting is the key. You have to use this key to cite this art, uh, the article which you want to cite here. So, in uh, this is the format you can use. Uh, here, uh, if I uh, start, execute it for citation to be included, you have to cite uh, compile the file three times. It is being compiled. Second time, third time. So when I show output, I have to share it again, the output. So this is the output of the, uh, what we have written uh, in LaTeX and included uh, this is sample document to understand different bibliography style like we have used abbreviation so one two three uh, abbreviations are used although a bib text file has more than three every uh, references uh bib text entries uh, but whatever we have cited that will be included in the main document so these three are being included here we have used uh, abbreviation, so it is the first name, dot, last name, and uh, second author, dot, the title of the research paper, then, uh, then the journal of where the research paper is published, then comma, then volume number, then issue number, then year. So this, um, in this manner, it automatically uh, gets the record from BibTeX and converts into the appropriate bibliographic style. Like I will show again, BibTeX entry, for example, this was the first author. And uh, a title authors uh, first name uh, last name first name and the other one then journal name volume issue and year so in this manner it was shown uh, in the output pdf file similarly second reference and third reference is uh, used now if uh, we want to change the style of this uh, file uh, so if we want to use instead of abbreviation we want to use uh, for example acm style for acm style we have to use bibliographic style acm we compile it again the file we just compiled it and it will be formatted according to the acm style i have compiled it three times then i will show the output and 
the output is now it is according to acm style in acm style it is uh, the last name or author names are capitalized and uh, journal uh, volume number and issue number are separated by commas so it is totally different style in uh, if you have conference proceeding then it will have page numbers are referenced as pp so this manner we ha can have uh, a cm style we i will show you a different style now i will use uh, alpha style and show check what will be the effect of alpha style on the output i will compile it again it is the pdf file so you have i have to compile it three times and check the output and show share the output with you so the output is here uh, bht in alphabetical style uh, and different things like bht uh, and 10 so it will be uh, used in alph alphabetical style So, th so this is uh, the output of uh, alphabetical style, alpha style. So it uh, has shown uh, in parentheses BHT like uh, reference uh, name, and it is uh, totally different from the previous which you have uh, seen, uh, like ACM style. And now I will change it uh, reference style to APA like, like if you want to have commit to a social science journal. So I will compile it again. And I will check the output here and share with the you output the output here it is like APA style it is previously APA style uh, uh, previous version of APA so it is Ben Hang and Tom Pro the names of authors last name of authors and uh, comma year comma next author uh, author uh comma next option so in this manner we will uh can have uh apa style so it's a, just a matter of uh, one command you can have different apa style different styles in bibtex format so if i comment and last one i will show you i triple it uh, transaction style The output of this style is uh, one, two, three, and the first name is uh, abbreviated dot last name and e dot first name dot last name and uh, journal uh, article name is uh, in uh, quotes and volume number is uh, shown as bol dot uh, next volume number comma num issue number no, no dot issue number and uh, in this manner we can have different 
uh, formats for the uh, insert uh, journal which you, you want to submit. Even you want to uh, have uh, for your search thesis, you can have different formats according to your uh, university. Thank you very much.